see how big I got just throughout my junior and senior year. And then about a week before I came, Coach Dunlap called me and told me he wanted me to play Bandit. So I started just going out, working on my back pedal, my open field stuff. Stop eating? No, I still eating. I came in about 210, but since we did all the running, I'm about 205 solid. You didn't want to mess with that in there, did you? Huh? Were you in the other room? I just left it. The big guy. <laughs> How, how have you done trying to get a feel for this defense? Obviously, it's not you know, the easiest defense to try to understand. Um, I mean, I'm doing good. I think the coaches are pleased with what I learned by now about being a freshman. But you're a D1 athlete, so you have to, you have to proceed at all expectations. So, I mean, I think I'm doing good for being a freshman, but I could do a lot better. Who is, who is the one player, maybe more than anybody else, that's trying to spend time with you, watching film, uh, out there on the field, instructing you, helping you out? I mean, I can't really point out one, but uh, Darwin Cook, he's been helping me a lot because he plays the same position I play. But in the summer, it was uh, Keith Tandy. He was the one staying out me after practice. When I got here late, he was the one trying to show me around, the one paying an effort to, for me to learn and be in the best position to play right now. Have you envisioned what that field's going to be like when there's 60-some 60, 60 thousand fans out there? I mean, no, you can't picture it until it really happens, so I'm just waiting for when we play Marshall to see what my experience is going to be like. Uh, so it's banging up, just banging, a little swollen, so I got a little ice on it. What's been the toughest adjustment for you so far? Uh, the speed, the speed of the game. I mean, it's a lot faster. You got to run to the ball wherever the ball's at. I mean, it's just different. It's, just, it's not high school no more, so everything's different. It's a lot faster at safety than it is line too. Yes, yeah, sir, you got that right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, coach has been on me about getting deeper in the post. I mean, I think I'll be deep, but like, you can get deeper. So, I mean, it's just a different aspect of the game that I got to learn, playing safety, but coming from linebacker in high school. How about this? You talk about speed. How about the tempo that the offense will run at here? I mean, is that anything you've ever seen before? No, I mean, the speed, the speed of the tempo of the offense that we're running now with Coach Dan uh, is just unbelievable. I mean, that's where the defense get our conditioning from. I mean, we don't run sprints after practice, but just running into the huddle and running to the ball is a lot of conditioning for us. You talked about getting to the point where you're not thinking and you're just playing. Is it a matter of just learning the system better? I mean, how do you get to the point where you're just playing? I mean, when you when you gain confidence in yourself is when you just start start playing. I mean, so... I'm out there with the one, so I mean, I'm, I feel like when something goes wrong, it's on me because I'm the freshman off the bunch, so I'm doing a lot of extra thinking, but the coaches just emphasize me to just play. What was going through your mind the first day after your first practice? You get up in the morning and... What was that question again? What was that? What was going through your mind uh, when you woke up after the f first practice? I mean, got to do it all over again. <laughs> was it, I mean, were you surprised by a lot of the things that, that you gone through that first day, or was it... I mean, the first day was pretty good. I mean, there was no pads on, so I really didn't. I really wasn't thinking that day for the rest of the week because I knew we was going to put pads on while the days went by. So once the first day got the pads, I was pretty like, all right, I could do this. It's, uh, it, took, it didn't take very long. Until you I didn't take very long. It definitely got it that fast. You surprised yourself? I mean, new position coming in here, you know, freshman, and still – being able to run with the ones after a, you know 10, 12 practices? Yeah, I'm very surprised. I mean, I'm confident in myself, but coming to a new system and a new defense and a whole nother level, I was very shocked to myself that I was able to be out there and be capable of doing some of the things that I did. I mean, but there's a lot of room to improve. When Coach Dunlap called you and, suggest, and, and said that, yeah, I want to try it, Bandit, uh, was there any moment where you hung up the phone and thought, ah, man, I want to be a linebacker? Or was it something you just embraced from the beginning? No, I mean, I was I was happy that he told me I was going to play safety because looking at the offensive linemen around the college football league, uh, I didn't think I'd be able to handle it <laughs> at the size that I am, weighing about 200 pounds and the linemen about 300. So I was I was very happy when he told me I'd be playing safety. Thanks a lot,